This sports segment of Naperville News 17 is brought to you by R.R. Donnelly, enabling the future of innovative communications. Hey everyone, I'm Commandant Chev. Neuqua Valley Baseball has had an incredible season to say the least. The Wildcats 31-1 on the air, taking on Matia Valley in a regional semi. The Mustangs coming off a comeback win over Wabonzi, but a tougher test in this one as Noah Herdman puts Neuqua Valley in front with an RBI single scoring the fired up James Gargano. Then Jack Ragoni lines a single in almost the exact same spot to make it 2-0. That's all the run support James Kulak would need. He struck out six. Kulak was dealing and had a perfect game going in the sixth as he just misses with this pitch. That was his only walk of the game, but he regroups nicely fielding his position on this hard grounder to get the out. Seventh inning now, one out to go. Kulak still has a no hitter and he gets the strikeout. The Wildcats win 7-0, advancing to the regional final. Same two schools in a soccer sectional semi. Neuqua Valley, the undefeated DVC champs, but it's Matia Valley that gets off to a good start. A few fortunate bounces and Chesney Wargo pounces for the 1-0 lead. Later in the first half, Neuqua corner, Ryan Garris with a good cross, the ball bouncing around, and Haley Furio with the header that floats in for the game time goal. Late in the half, Sophia Sinise splits the defense with a good ball to Sophia Maher, who slots it home for the nice finish. 57th minute now, still 2-1 MV. Nikki Hernandez with a nice long ball. Maeve Reardon runs onto it and crosses to Sydney Rahm, who puts it in. Matia makes its fourth straight sectional final and will play Naperville North. A tough loss for the Nequa soccer team, but a huge week for the Wildcats, as the boys volleyball team took on Glenbard East in a regional final. The Wildcats, the underdog, is the sixth seed against the third seeded Rams. Tied at a set apiece, Neek win control in the third set. Kevin Calling with one of his 25 assists to AJ Householder for the powerful kill. NV up 22 17. Neek was showing off the defense as well. Jeremy Cardenas with the big block, the sixth seed sniffing the upset. Match point for the Wildcats. Cardenas trying to put it away, but the Rams with some nice defense keeping it alive, but only for so long as Cardenas having no trouble, the running spike to put the match away. The Wildcats win their second straight regional title. To college sports, North Central Baseball is headed to the D3 College World Series for the second time in school history and the first time since 1987. The Cardinals offense is led by first-time All-Americans Nick Sotiros and Michael Mateja, North Central starts World Series play this weekend at UW Oshkosh. And finally, the Naperville Country Club hosted some of the top men's and women's college golf teams as they practiced in preparation for the D1 championships, which are currently going on in Sugar Grove, Illinois. USC and Vanderbilt were the men's teams in town, while the Furman and Kent State women's teams also practiced at NCC. That's sports. Alyssa, back to you. Thanks, Common. Tune into Naperville Sports Weekly this Sunday night for playoff highlights in girls' soccer, baseball, softball, and boys' lacrosse. 